I can't believe I didn't record this as I was doing this, but I had my first uh, YouTube uh, sale going on. Um, selling out on the mags. Doing a little wholesale on that. Getting rid of them because I've sold about 40, 45 of them. One, one to, you know, three or four at a time here and there. Um, I actually sent in here for him to, uh, because he always says he's getting fucked by resellers. So I actually put a little uh, uh, sexy lingerie, female lingerie and a thong in here for him. And I told him to uh, put this on next time the resellers are fucking him. <laughs> but I found that dumpster diving, so I figured, you know what I mean. We'll see how he uh, reacts when he opens it. But I have the uh, Mario wrapped up in there. And then underneath is the Mario and bubble wrap. The uh, Wii box, the collector's box, 25th anniversary one. And then the other ones are in there. Um, you can check out his video to see him unwrap it. But I just didn't have time to record it all. So this is the very first Megapath Presents uh, YouTube deal going down. Uh, I also threw in a little, some extras. There's a lanyard, um, a GameStop lanyard I threw in. Just to rub it in their face for dumpster diving, you know what I mean? And then uh, some iPhone chargers. He said he had an iPhone. Um, some extra iPhone chargers. There's a little bit of... Some extras I don't, you know what I mean? I have too many for. Of So, that's it. We're going to tape it up, ship it out. You know, first YouTube sale. Is uh, Trade with Cobra Timmy. Here's his channel. Here's a... Uh, Little look at the most recent vids he did. And look at he's got a bunch. Alright, I am here it is. I uh I took the little the little stuff out and packed it away and whatnot, did what I needed to with it, but this is just awesome. I mean <laughs> I just, words don't describe how awesome this is. Uh, first off, I don't even mind having to hunt down the other controller. He did text me after I told my openness and said, uh, you know, he really wishes that uh, they had the, the jungle, what is it, jungle green controller. And I really, really don't mind. Uh, I don't mind at all. I mean, and, oh, and I need that cover for the expansion pack, and it does have an expansion pack, as you can see. So this is just awesome. I mean, it, and it is nice condition too. I got to get the cover and then get, uh, get the cover and get the paddle. So I am going to be on the hunt for this paddle, which again I said it before. I enjoy that shit. We got two controllers. That is perfect. Again, one would have sufficed. Black Label Final Fantasy 7, which is great. I needed to add this into my collection, so just awesome. And I mean, the discs are even in fantastic condition. I mean, fantastic condition. Look at that. All three discs are like that. A little bit of dust spots, but uh, I hit a rag, a microfiber rag to that, and it'll be fine. But as long as the scratches aren't there... Great, 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 and I just been—I just was saying I want to get back into the Final Fantasy franchise, and I want to go back and play all the Final Fantasies. So this is awesome. Uh, some NES excitement here. I've never actually seen this out in the wild, so I'm really, really glad this was included in the deal. And again, uh, I was so busy and so uh, flustered when he said he had Mario Brothers, the arcade version. I just had no clue what he was talking about. And I'm so used to people getting things mistaken that I thought he was going to send me the Mario and Duck Hunt without the Duck Hunt and think it was something special. I've had so many different people. Uh, you know Mario and Duck Hunt, uh, if you get them, the Nintendo is like in different spots or it says something different and then the seal is different uh... some people think it's like super special or whatever and i find them everywhere so i was really hoping that, that wasn't the case <laughs> so i was really glad when i saw this so that is just great and again a huge huge teenage mutant ninja turtle fan i mean absolutely huge me and my daughter watched the cartoons every saturday as a matter of fact we just got done watching uh... today's um, I love the Nickelodeon Ninja Turtles that are on right now. Fucking love them. Anyway, this is awesome. The Manhattan Project, super cool. Take off that 50 cent with some... Uh 
So again, Cobra Timmy. Now this wasn't even a trade. I answered a <clears throat> a, a trivia question right on uh, Sam's video, and he sent me a nice care package. <clears throat> I'll show you the package in a minute, but here's his most recent finds. This is another guy with each video he does, he gets better and better. So go ahead and check him out. Sam Fasamanu. And he's real good about sending you something, you know? So. And this is the uh, Uncharted 3 sealed from Sam Fasamanu. A little something, a little extra something he didn't have to do, but he did. Uh, great guy. Check him out. Sam Fasamanu. Another one is In the Huddle SC. And he gave me. I actually, as soon as I got it, I sent it away uh, to a storage unit in a different state, the one that I'm moving to. But this is the item uh, right here that he sent me for trade. That's what it would look like put together. I'm really excited to get this item because Twisted Metal was one of me and my brother's favorite, favorite PlayStation 1 games alongside of Intelligent Cube. Intelligence Cube or, uh, yeah. Anyway, um, absolutely loved it. I really do want to get back into the series. And, uh, because I haven't played it since the original, you know. But anyway, or since Black, I should say. Anyway, uh, in the Huddle SC, he finds a lot of great retro shit. That's why I really, really wish, he makes me really, really wish I had a retro store near me. <laughs> All right, guys, in the huddle. And last but not least, getting your nerd on. They just uh, added the uh, coolness of their awesomeness. Sent me a pack of uh, Tomb Raider cards. Uh, they were like for the uh, for a game or whatever. Um, but I love any and all things Tomb Raider. So uh, they said, uh, "Screw it, we'll send you something." <clears throat> and then I sent him, I sent Zach a Pokemon manual for uh, Pokemon Diamond for the DS that uh, he needed for his collection. And he said he was going to uh, go ahead and send me something out. He really doesn't have to, but, you know, it's something nice. I'm never going to tell someone uh, don't. You know what I mean? I just, if I really wanted to send someone something, I'd kind of feel uh, uh, rejected if somebody told me no. It's like, wow, I'm not even good enough to send you something for free. So, again, they really... He really doesn't have to, but again, that's how cool they are. Uh, so they do pick up videos right now. I am talking them into doing some dumpster diving, but <laughs> we'll see. So check them out. Getting your nerd on. Great, great duo right there. All right, guys. A little something when Dumpster Marcus came down. He just handed me a Game Gear. He knew I wanted it. We were talking about it uh, previously. When he came down, I gave him a little care package to go, and even though he uh, did me a solid and helped me out with the kiosk, he still handed me a Game Gear, which is awesome. It's even got uh, the back here where the batteries go. Some of those, sometimes they're uh, missing that. And, uh, yeah, that's that. Pretty awesome. You know what, guys? I wanted to get another setup. And I wanted to show you the paperwork I had with it that went with the press kit. I can't find the paperwork, so I'm just going to uh, show you this setup real quick. And I just want to say uh, there was a big fuss about why I only showed one dog tag, okay, out of the four. Uh, and the reason being is they're all the same. They're all gold, and they all say the same stuff. Battlefield 4 on 1 and prepare for battle in some kind of um, sticks and stones type of lettering. Anyway... I didn't feel I needed to show them all. Apparently I do, okay, because somebody called, called me out and pretty much said I was a liar. I only showed one because the other three were silver. If they were silver, I would have showed you they were silver. That's the point of this channel, to show you what we have rescued out of the dumpster, okay? And uh, <clears throat> so this is just to show you guys. I know my true subscribers, I know they know I was, you know, telling the truth or whatever, so... I don't know if I don't know if the other dude is uh, who tried to call me out on this is a hater. I don't know if he's mad that he had to buy his. Um, I don't know. Not I know he got it for free, but he did have to buy. You know what I mean? He did have to put money down to get it. Uh, maybe he got another one for free. I don't know. But as far as I know, he he put money down for his. Uh, I didn't. I found it in a dumpster. I rescued it. It's mine. You know what I'm saying? 
I gave the, the other one away to Dumpster Marcus. Watch his video. You will see his is gold as well. If you don't believe him, ask him. Dumpster Marcus, comment below. Is your gold or silver? Uh, all right, guys. This is just to uh, shut up someone who's calling me a liar. So I'm done with this. You know what I mean? I'm done with it. I don't want to carry on this little back and forth like bitches no more. It's fucking over. It's done with. All right? This is it. Thank you, guys. And peace.